Chloe has shut down the internet and shut down any doubts that anyone had that Robert Kardashian is her father. And she's doing so with her son, Tatum. It is Tatum's first birthday. And honestly, I don't think anyone is even looking at the tribute that Chloe has posted for her son. You know why? Chloe's son, his features, his face, his presence, he's capturing it all. Like this boy is saying, you know what? I don't want to look like my mom. I don't want to look like my dad. I want to look like my grandpa. My granddad is my hero. <laughs> Listen, genet genetics is so weird. It is so incredible. If you guys remember, it was just a few months ago that Candace Owens, you know, did a video saying that Khloe Kardashian's father is black. But heck no, Tatum is saying, my mommy's dad is Robert Kardashian. Look at me, honey. I'm all Robert Kardashian. Let me tell you, the internet is talking and everyone believes that Tatum looks like Robert Kardashian and Sam West because we know that Sam West looks like Robert Kardashian. Mm -hmm. But Tatum, Tatum is given, sorry, all Robert Kardashian. You look at this baby boy, you can say, okay, he's given half black. Yeah, we can see that he's half black, but he's not giving anything Tristan Thompson, nothing whatsoever. This boy is not giving anything daddy. He's giving his grandfather, Robert Kardashian. Yes, I've said it before, and I'm going to say it again. I mean, Chloe is currently trending, and we love that for Chloe on so many levels. Now, you're kind of getting the sense of why Chloe might not have been able to bond with her son, and I don't think it's just surrogacy. I think that Chloe actually set up herself for a disappointment when she learned that, you know, the surrogate was carrying a boy. I think that her, her entire world was built around this child looking exactly like Tristan Thompson because true, true looks like Tristan Thompson, right? But just imagine looking at this baby and looking at him like, heck, where the heck are you from? But if we all remember, this is the same thing that Kris Jenner said when Chloe was born. Everyone was shocked by Chloe's genetics. Everyone was like, where the heck is this child from? Because her appearance was just so different. And that's how the rumor of her not being Robert Kardashian's daughter started. But if anyone had any doubt that Chloe was or is, in fact, Robert Kardashian's daughter. Tatum is dismissing all of that doubt. And I honestly love this for Chloe. This baby boy is so chunky. He's so cute. You just want to hug him, squish him, and never, ever let him go. He's such a cutie. Oh, Tristan, I'm kind of happy this boy looks nothing like Tristan. I'm actually happy that he looks just like his grandfather for so many reasons, more than one. It means that a lot of people will be finally able to put Chloe's, the question around Chloe's DNA to rest, right? But let's talk about the tribute for a second, can we? But listen, I am obsessed with this little man. I am obsessed with his genetics, right? In a good, healthy way, because I'm just saying, just look at this miracle child. Look at genetics at work. Look at genetics at play. Now, Tatum, Tatum definitely looks like Chloe, right? But it's giving, if Chloe should have a baby with her dad, rap, um, Robert Kardashian, this would be how the child look minus his, um, you know, um, black DNA because that part is definitely coming through. It's definitely showing. But let's talk a little bit about Chloe's tribute to Tatum, right? Because she is also acknowledging that 
Tatum looks like her dad. I guess it's a really, um, I would have to say, popular discussion around the Kai Jenner clan of how much and how cr incredible God is knowing that Tatum came out looking like his grandfather. So let's talk about that tribute. So Khloe Kardashian posted, Happy birthday, my sweet son. I am a firm believer in that God gives you what you need, and I needed you. God knew my heart needed you. I needed your sweet and precious smile. I needed your angelic spirit. I needed a love only you could give me. I needed my son. I am so proud to be your mommy, so proud of the love and laughter we have in our house, so proud of your beautiful, gentle, loving, infectious spirit. You light up every single room. There's no denying that everyone smiles when they look at you, especially true. She's so proud to call you hers. Tatum, you have changed mine and True's life forever. We both needed you. I knew she would be a fantastic, loving older sister, but I don't think I ever could imagine that love and bond you guys already have. You both remind me so much of Uncle Bob and I. So she's saying that, you know, True and um, Tatum's bond reminds her of the bond that she has with her brother, Rob. Now, um, Chloe continued by saying, it's fitting since I think you look so much like your uncle, which means I think you look like my dad too. Definitely. But what I find interesting about this tribute is that um, we're not, why are we not seeing anything about Tristan, right? I don't know if you guys are looking into that. I see absolutely nothing about Tristan Thompson in this tribute, right? And uh, let's start off, let's continue, sorry, with the ending of this beautiful post from Chloe to her son. She says, mommy and Tutu love you, our little Armenian man, because he definitely looks Armenian. No ifs, no buts, no maybe is Armenian roots is just standing out. So no matter how much plastic surgery Chloe has done to look like a white woman, her son is saying, my mom is Armenian. And it is standing out 110%. But I'm kind of concerned as to why is it that Tristan is always there with Chloe, but um, she didn't include um, Tristan's name. Maybe Tristan thinks that, maybe Chloe thinks that, you know, if she includes Tristan's name, she would face major backlash for that. And she doesn't want that negativity on her post regarding her son's birthday. No. Listen, the comment section was like celebrating for Chloe. One person said Sam's twin somehow. Another person said all of the OJ paternity accusers are silent after this. That is Robert Kardashian's blood. Definitely 100%. Another person says, someone explain, please, her son, right? This boy is like, you know, someone else's child. But again, as I've said, ge genetics is just so incredible. Um, genetics have you questioning a lot of things. Many of us didn't saw this coming. Um, and we couldn't have seen it coming either. But the comment section kept on going. Everyone says, we see Robert Kardashian. This is Robert Kardashian's child. It says though Robert Kardashian was saying, you know what? I'm not going to allow you guys to be down there having all these babies and some of them not looking like me. That is not going to happen. <laughs> oh God. I love this. I honestly love this. I love this for Chloe. I love that, you know, people can actually stop questioning her DNA. I love that she's just shutting the internet down in so many ways, more than one. And we just cannot get enough 
of this little man, Tatum. But I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what your thoughts are. And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Share if you care. And talk to you all later. Bye, guys.